Tutorial number 71. In this tutorial, we're going to talk about the next surface tool, the extrude or sweep surface. It is not activated here. So let's start some sketches to to make a sweep. So let's start this profile it and try to find another profile to be perpendicular to that profile in order to sweep so we have to plane make an s line so here you can decide the shape of sweep Let's exit. So now you notice the sweep surface is activated. You have two surfaces, the profile and the path. So let's activate the sweep. The profile is here select to be the path. So it's not the right selection. So you select sketch one as profile. The path will be this. So when you're done, click OK. So this is the very simple sweep choice. And you can try to edit and see the different options. So here you have polypath. So it gives you a very simple sweeping. And you have keep normal constant. So it will the profile will continue being constant the whole sweeping way. So if you click OK, so you see the difference between exit or edit here. You can also twist along path. So here you can see the twisting when you are increasing. So we can make it. 90 degree or let's make another angle and here you can revolve the twisting direction let's edit again and here you have twist along with the normal constant Right, five to degree. And let's try to make another option or another trick with this twisting. If you go to edit, follow path, you have twist along the path, and you have either to select with degrees or with turns. For example, if you can select turns, five turns, click OK. So you are twisting and making this special rod. So there are many options to do to create your almost any shape you want on SolidWorks.